went further. I have found the perfect designer bags for summer 2024. Also, I did my hair myself. I actually did it myself. Yeah. So apologies if it's not great, but this is what we're dealing with. So whether you're wanting to flex at the resort, on the streets, wherever you may be finding yourself in hot weather, maybe at home, if you are blessed with such heat. Wherever you may be, these picks that I've got today are focusing on wicker, raffia, bright colours, crochet, summery fabrics and materials, beach bags, hands-free bags so you don't need to worry when you're exploring somewhere new. And whilst they may be for summer, you can bring these out year after year after year. We're not talking about suede, we're not talking about harsh black leather that somehow sort of melts and weighs you down uh, during those hot days. And while summer I shall not be recommending any Prada net bags, you know how I feel about those, and especially especially for the prize, it's insulting. So I hope that you like my picks today. I think I've got something for everybody. Links will be below in the shopping button on the screen. Speaking of Prada, don't look at that crochet little limp sack that is very similar to something that you may get free with purchase literally anywhere else. Instead, cast your eyes over to this mini wicker bag. This actually comes in three sizes. They do a mini, a small, no, they do a mini, a medium, and a large. That's it. And they also do this in three different styles. You've got it in um, this sort of like little rectangular style with linen top handles and a linen interior. You've got a version that is a wicker version of the RK bag, so that moon bag shape. And you have a camera bag style with a leather top handle and leather crossbody strap. I think in terms of hardware and durability that's maybe the best one to get all of these bag styles are very versatile you could wear these gallivanting through a town during the day and to a fancy dinner on a yacht on a yacht at night so you can dress up and dress them down but you have that really rigid super summery wicker picnic basket look and i just think it looks brilliant like i said the rectangular one has little linen top handles keep that in mind the linen aspect um it's a very summery fabric it's maybe not the best hard wearing that's why i sort of think maybe the camera bag style is the most hard wearing of all of them if you want to do a summer bag and you really want to drive this home it's wicker that is your summer commitment guys if you are new here my name is cassie and i'm a self-diagnosed luxury addict i put out videos on mondays wednesdays and fridays so if you like luxury fashion then you're gonna love it here so head on that subscribe turn on the bell become a member of our luxury addicted family when are we going to rehab <laughs> Never. The next one I briefly have spoken about uh, in another video. This is the Loewe pocket bag. Why am I not hearing more about this? Because I think in terms of value for money, this is a great one. It's a very cute little um, raffia mini bag, crossbody style, not removable crossbody. Okay, so she's a crossbody and that's it. Drawstring closure. And then there's two different styles that they do this in. You either have like a checkerboard raffia that comes in pink, uh, like a bright pink and a lime green. You know, I love the lime green. With the leather Loewe anagram on the front, or there's a version that's a little bit more toned down in the khaki. And I think for essentials, like I said, if you want a hands-free, you're exploring something light, easy to pack, scrunch it in a corner, this is a really great option. Also, Loewe's Paula's Ibiza line for the summer is just brilliant every year. Really, any of those bags you can't go wrong with, but then we would be here for three hours. You know what, this is also really good for like festivals, concerts, for like little essentials. And the vibes are giving sort of like, she can work for the jungle, she can work for Ibiza, she can work for, um, the streets of the south of France. She's versatile and she gives a summary pop. The next is the Kate Olivia Hobo bag. This style we've seen done before for in more wintry, I would say, fabrics. In suede, it's particularly po uh, popular, the Olivia bag. This is just a really great oval shaped, slouchy shoulder bag style. But for the summer, they've done it in raffia. And Again, they're doing this in a few colours. There's a red, there's like a natural raffia colour, that beige. There's also a sort of yellow, pale yellow version. Obviously, you know I love the green. It's a grassy green, 
So it's more of a green that um, if you're scared of the lime green on the little Loewe bag that I just told you about, maybe this sort of green is more suited to you. It's a simple style, but I like her. She gives summer, she gives chic, easy to pack once again. That is going to be one of those that you can fold and scrunch and have no problems. In terms of closure, the two sort of sides do cave in on each other to have a bit of closure. There is also like a tie. I think that tie is like, that's what you came up with. I don't even know if I would tie it after I would just use the, the sides. It's a very good everyday bag, but you still want to bring a lot with you. The Jimmy Doo Bonbon Bucket. I think they did this very well. You know, sometimes I'm a bit weird with shoe brands that go into bags and I'm like, stay in your line. But the bonbon is, I really like the bonbon, to be honest with you. And I think this summer version is great. Little, slouchy little bucket bag style in the raffia. You have this patterned silk twilly that's tied all fancy and pretty and cute at the front. But what I like here is the chain, like little chains that attach to the handles that are made of leather and metal. I really like the structure of the handle against the soft body of the rest of the bag. And also comes with a crossbody strap. So again, you want to do a top handle for the evening, you want to do a crossbody for during the day, you've got the options. When it comes to summer, I do love a little bit of PVC, I do love a bit of transparency, a little bit of vinyl. But it depends how it's done. Cause sometimes it's like, I don't need you seeing the innards of my life through my bag like that. This uh, Saint Laurent one, I think is, gives more of a translucent. Okay, so you get, the good things that we like about PVC and vinyl, which is the wipe clean. These are perfect for by the pool, by the beach, spills, any of that, you don't need to worry about it. If you're even more worried, go for the colorway that is the green vinyl against the black shiny leather, because that's going to be even easier to clean. The closure on this is the little foot of the L of the YSL threads through the leather hoop, which I do think is very cute. But this is a very good, it's that typical summery bucket bag style, bucket, like basket, basket, bucket, basket, there's so many different styles. Basket style that is, that we see a lot during the summer, but I think you're going to fit all of your beach essentials in there, roll up your towel and your sunglasses and your Kindle and your magazines and whatever else and your three liters of water and everything and you're good to go and you don't need to worry. She's a little bit of like a hands off, she's going to do the job for you, you don't need to worry about babying her. However, she does have structure, so if you're going to be travelling with her, she might also have to be your carry-on, or put her in the case, no, no, you don't want to put this in your in your hold luggage. No, she's going to have to be your carry-on. I love this bag, I've spoken about it before. I will speak about it again. This is the Poochie Yummy Shoulder Bag, and isn't the name apt, because she is delicious. This is a very simple shoulder bag style done in the iconic Pucci print. And Pucci is summer, okay? I don't make the rules. Much like Mariah Carey is Christmas, Pucci is summer. That wave design, this bag comes in three different colorways. There's a green one that's maybe a little bit more neutrals. There's a sort of light blue pastel. And then you've got the really bright multicolor having a great time. It is slightly bigger than the Prada version of this bag, right? So you're getting a lot more in there. It is nylon, so, you know, it's going to be nicely hard wearing. It's soft, it's light, it's easy to pack. It's just so much fun and I love it. And the thing is, is that although I've said Poochie is to summer as my care is to Christmas, I still love this worn with an autumn outfit, with a, with, with a winter outfit, all black with this bag having a little bit of a pop. Now, while I'm here, did you know that they do a bag called the Puccinella? And did you know it's a tiny body as a bucket bag with a little bikini? I'm sorry, it's just very cute. If you like the novelty, you want a little bit of fun, it looks like a matryoshka, like a little Russian nesting doll. It's quite cute, it's rather hilarious. You also may be interested in that. Now, personally, when it comes to my pick for a beach bag, I want something that's packable because I have my like go-to carry-on uh, bags that I use for that and I don't like to, I'm a creature of habit, okay? So my next suggestion is the Loewe Fold Shopper and Fold She 
does. You can again squeeze this into a corner and she's going to bounce back like nothing's happened. I don't think the green is available. I got this last year. I mean, it's absolutely huge. You are getting everything in there. I shoved whatever I wanted to shove into this bag and it was brilliant. I love the dual handles, okay? I also love the take on an Ikea bag of it all. You know, it's a, it's a Loewe version of an Ikea bag uh, done in raffia, ready for the summer. They do this in all black and in the natural raffia as well. They do a leather version of this in more colours, but we're not interested in the leather for the summer, okay? We're trying to keep things light and easy breezy. So this is a brilliant option. It serves me very well for my holidays and I had to mention her. As we know, Miu Miu as a brand is having a moment. And there aren't many Miu Miu bags that sort of do something for me, but I saw this and I was like, you've executed this very well. Again, in the wicker, this is a take on the Wanda style that they do that's very popular, but it's done in that lovely hard shell wicker. I love the gold patent letters spelling out the Miu Miu on the front. That also matches a little bit of a leather interior trim, a leather interior trim underneath the handle, and the crossbody strap. I think that this is just so cute. And again, like the gold against the raffia, because sometimes with like the natural raffia thing, it plays very neutral um, and casual, but I just love the pop of gold against it because it dresses it up slightly, but not in a way that's like, oh, I can't use this as a daily bag. She is giving day to night. Whatever situation you find yourself in, in the summer, she's getting, well, not for by the beach. Well, for by the beach, just for like essentials, but not for by the beach, like with your book and your towel and whatever. Fine, you know what I mean? Basically, I love this bag. The Bottega Candy Wallace. I really like this specific bag style for the summer because it's just very carefree, throw in, have it hanging off your elbow, you know, and go about your life. They Okay, so the Wallace style, they do in a few sizes anyway. The Candy Wallace comes in some really bright, rich, beautiful summer colors. Um, there's a great blue, there's a great yellow, there's a mint green, however, if we go up a size slightly, okay. Oh, and also the um, the strap is adjustable, so you can do you can do her here and you can do her on the shoulder as well. Also, there's something about Bottega Intrecciato weave that reads summery to me. It's versatile in that it can do all seasons, but I do think that weave aspect it reminds me of raffia. It reminds me of those wicker bags. Anyway, there is a version of this bag in in a slightly larger size, that is woven with raffia, and that perfection. I think that that just looks great. Versatile, interesting, but still easy to use. This is like a very fab option, as in this is a lovely little bougie moment. Olympia Latan. She creates these clutches that look like books, and half the time they play on books, like she has a burn book version, I think it's like a Pride and Prejudice, you know all the classics, she's probably, she, her, she's probably done a bag on, on them. What I think is such a moment is if you have an Olympia Latan clutch for your holiday destination. I love it. It's like collecting a travel guide, but as a bag. It's just, she does Venice, Italian Dream, Latina Beach Club, Buttermentera, there's a bento box one. Imagine that bento box being used in Japan. Oh my gosh, perfection. There's a Provence, there's a Palm Beach, it is painfully chic. And I just had to express this vision to you of mine. The Louis Vuitton Carry All PM. This bag is part of the nautical collection. So they've done a bit of a take on it that's not just in your normal canvas. This is like a beige, non-coated canvas. And the monograms are actually woven through with I think 66 different multicolored threads. So you do have this colorful aspect, but in a way that's like a little bit more subdued and not as like in your face as if, if, if you said to somebody, it's got 66 different colors, that sounds a lot. And again, because it's on the monogram, it's smaller, it's like a little bit more subtle, but this is a good everyday medium size, I still need my stuff with me, slouchy bag style. You've got compartments inside, you've got a zip pocket, you've got this little mirrored luggage tag there for a bit of, for a bit of something. I don't know what, but I thought that this was good if you want like a user-friendly everyday bag that is summer adjacent. And then the Valentino Loco Raffia bag. This is a raffia version of 
the Valentino Loco bags that they do. The V logo clasp on the front of the bag has got some gems in it and has crystals. So there's, we're already talking a certain level of razzle dazzle against the very casual feeling raffia, okay? So again, she's giving day to night like it's nobody's business. She's a three in one as well. So you have the leather top handle, you have the chain strap that can double up and do a shoulder or could, you can do as a single and a crossbody that is also detachable. So, so she's actually a four in one because you can get rid of all of the straps and do a clutch. If you want a bag that's going to work for you on holiday, okay, you're like, listen, I can only take one bag that's going to do it all. This is the one. Let me know which one was your favorite. I'm going to leave a link to another video over here in case you haven't already seen it. Have an amazing morning, afternoon, or evening, wherever you are. And in the words of my father. If you've enjoyed it, tell your friends. If you haven't, keep your mouth shut. I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.